it what up? What up? What up? What up? It's Garage Gym Homie. Is it worth it? What up? What up? What up? It's Garage Gym Homie. Hey, is it worth it? Hey, what up? What up? What up? It's Garage Gym Homie. Hey, is it worth it? Hey. What up? What up? It's Garage Gym Homie. And today, I'm reviewing Killer Labs. Stim Reaper pre-workout. Is it worth it? Before we get into this here, please click the subscribe button. I got content coming out all the dang time for you homies. So click subscribe and let's get into this. Man, hey, homie, we, we in for this one today, man. Whoa, whoa, daddy. All right, man. Excuse me. Uh, if you like what I have to say about it, I'm gonna link below where to get it. This is certainly not for everybody. I'll tell you that right off the dang bat. This is not for everybody. And uh, you can also hit me in the email, garagegymhomie at gmail.com. I got a whole list of uh, cheap supplements I'm selling. I got a few left. Uh, I got my apparel, joggers, tanks, hoodies, stringers, uh, pullovers, uh, Tank, uh, I said tanks, t-shirts, all right, man, and uh, 12 steps for any suffering addicts or alcoholics, man. Let's get down to business. I reviewed their, uh, man, what was that pre-workout I call that, uh, not exterminate, <laughs> I forgot what their killer labs, uh, man, they had a killer pre-workout. It was, it was freaking awesome, man, uh, and then, uh, I reviewed the last Stim Reaper. Why can't I remember the name? Exterminator? Man, I'm tripping right now. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I know I'm way off, man. What the heck was that? Killer Labs? Whatever, man. I'll remember it later. This is going to drive me nuts. And uh, I've also reviewed, I have their uh, EAA formula or BCAA formula here to review. Very original. Uh, you could check out what's in there. And uh, I know they just came out with a fat burner. Good people over there, man, at Killer Labs. Good people. And um, also, uh, that's what I got to say. Now, let's get down to it. This is a stim package, homie. This is a stim pack. Look at that. This is intimidating, man. This is an intimidating pre-workout. Okay, so listen. They're talking. They're, are we doing facts or feelings up in here, son? They're claiming facts, but they're talking feelings. One scoop, six grams. It is a prop blend, homie, so I'll just say that. It's a furious punch flavor, and um, I think you're going to love it. And so it is a prop blend. Listen, man, everything has pros and cons. Obviously, prop blends are not ideal. We'd rather see fully disclosed labels. We don't think companies should have anything to hide. I know they can claim, oh, we don't want someone stealing our formula, boo freaking who. But as a consumer, we obviously want to know what we're putting in our body, especially something called Stim Reaper. Not to be confused with you, who's the Stim Creeper. You're the guy on all my videos who says, is there anything close to Excelsior? Is there anything close to Thermal Spark out? I want the closest thing to dark energy. You can't let go of it. I'm just so irritated. Every video I put out, man, I got someone asking if it's like Excelsior Dark. You just can't let it go, man. You can't move on with your life. Anyway, man, <laughs> I'm talking junk. But hey, if I irritated you, man, you should take a dang look at yourself, homie. All right, seriously. So the thing I know, but I'll say this about prop lines. Some of them freaking smack. And then you get a fully disclosed label, it lists all the dang ingredients. And you know it doesn't even have what they're listing. You can have a fully disclosed label that says 200 milligrams of DMHA. Ooh, wee, great. You let us know what's in there. You take it and you say, this doesn't have it. So prop lens don't mean much to me, man. I mean, if, as long as it's a company I trust that I know is manufactured properly. So you got to shake this up, man. Shake it up because uh, this is strong right here, man. So let's get down to it. So six gram scoop, very low scoop. I like it, man. I'm going to tell you why. And you've got 30 servings in a container, man. 30. Not 25, homie. 30. So they're giving you great high stim pre-workout, 30 servings. Beta alanine, 3 grams. Taurine, 1 gram. Then you get to the killer energy matrix. Caffeine anhydrous. Then you've got jugless regia fruit extract, 150 milligrams. They're telling you, 150, homie, DMHA. Uh, is it that ICP, America's Most Wanted, Juglins, uh, 
uh, English walnut, uh, UK trash DMHA, or is this that higher than giraffe vagina, high on the PP tingle scale, Fauci synthetic lab leak theory DMHA? We're gonna find out here, man. I'm gonna give it to you straight. Then you got Infinergy, man, dicaffeine malate, halostashine hydrochloride, which I think the last one had um, hortanine, I think, Sinephrine, get out of here, Coca-Butyrol, which is a great ingredient. Then, so that's the killer energy matrix. That's 850 milligrams. So we just don't know the uh, caffeine really in that one. The rest we don't really care about. And they told us the jugglins. The jugglins. What is a juggling? All right, man. Then you got Rewolfia vomitoria extract. Rewolfskine. You playing Wolfenstein, homie. GGH doing Rewolfskine. You on the computer, man, playing Duke Nukem Doom. Freaking... Wolfenstein still, homie. I'm pumping iron, taking Rewolfenstein. Re we ain't the same, homie. We ain't the, you playing games, dog. GGH don't play no dang games. And we don't know the alpha yo. So that, that to me is a, <laughs> that's bad. Because that's going to make or break. Some people will be like, I could take 1.5 milligrams of alpha yo. Some people can take three. I mean, we don't know the alpha yo in here. So that, that's the only part I'm upset about. <laughs> And then, I'm not really upset, but whatever. Then Hooper Zine, that gets you focused and dialed in, thinking about the weights, forgetting about your Tinder dates, because women don't like you, homeboy. So this is a uh, straight-up stim blend with a little beta alanine. And I like that there's no pump ingredients in here because you can uh, add a whole pump formula on top of it. I tell you, either give me a fully loaded pre-workout with pumps where I don't got to add anything, or give me a straight-up stim package where I can throw whatever pumps I want on it. So I love it. So anyway, man, I took the drink. One level scoop is six grams. And I'm going to say this. Do not take heaping scoops of this. If you're me, I, I ain't taking heaping scoops of this because this was strong as heck, man. So you take the drink. You come down to the dance floor. Uh, I'm telling you, you feel this boy hit in five minutes, homie. Five freaking minutes. You start feeling something. You get a, I'm not going to say you. I. I'm, excuse me. I started to get this little shaky feeling, man. <laughs> shaky feeling. Like, I don't want to use the word anxiety or fear or it was just more of a something's getting revved up, homie. Something's, something's, there's a driving force in me that's brewing. And you feel this physical, the shake feeling, man. And uh, that's how I felt. And then the beta comes in and you start feeling awake 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 the alpha yo comes in this is definitely a pre-workout if you like alpha yo you're gonna love this you have to like alpha yo to like this pre-workout because i would say the alpha yo is the star of the show with it and then comes the rest which i'm going to talk about so i just want to say this i'm just going to tell you what this pre-workout is like right off the bat picture insane lab psychotic with an illicit uh, with an illicit feeling added into it, meaning insane lab psychotic plus DMHA. So that's what that's pretty much what they came up with here. So a straight up little prop blend stim package with Alpha Yo being the star of the show with added DMHA in it. That's that's pretty much the experience, homie. So it's definitely. It's not a pre-workout where it just slaps you and you're like, oh my God, my heart. Da -da -da. It does not feel like death. There's, but there is this underlying, I'm freaking like, <laughs> there is like, like trembling that comes with it, man, because it's freaking strong, man. You got to be able to hand, not too strong, not death, no negative side effects if you're an alpha yo guy. If you're an alpha yo guy, you're going to love this. I mean, I didn't get hot and cold sweats. I didn't get chills, nose runs. Uh, there is a thermogenic effect. So the energy kind of hits you like within the first 20 minutes, the physical energy, and then the focus comes in. This was not a, um, for me, like, oh, I'm high. The Here's the thing about it. I think what's happening here with this pre-workout, they did a really nice job with it. I really liked it a lot. It's an experience, homie. This is not a daily hitter. You, this is a once in a while. If you just want to get, you know, that high physical energy, high focus, 
high drive. I mean, you're not going to want to wait between sets. You're I felt strong as heck on this pre-workout. This is definitely physical energy, star of the show. Then comes the mental. I think the Alpha Yo is strong enough on here. The Juglins is kind of, the DMHA is kind of competing with it. So it doesn't really give the DMHA a chance to like really shine. You know, a lot of pre-workouts, the DMHA is the star of the show. You're high, you're on one, you're buzzing, you're in a good mood. This made me feel more serious, man. More like I'm turning on some old little John. I'm turning on some Pantera. I'm turning on some Iron Pump. And I, I listen to Slayer, homie. I had on Seasons of the Abyss. I was like, I was like in the mood to be serious iron pumping, man. And um, even without a pump formula, man, my pumps were cool because you're just exhausting the muscle, man. You're just really freaking dialed into your training. There is kind of a high with it. I just think that it's competing with the Alpha Yo, so it's not, you got to look for it. You know, but you are zoned in, dialed in, thinking about the weights. You ain't swiping on Tinder on this one, homie. Put your dang phone away, jam the music, and go to town, man, on iron pumping because this is a serious pre right here. This is a strong pre, really good. As strong as a pre can get without feeling like death, without feeling like death. So the Juglins is there. The DMHA is there. I'm telling you, picture insane lab psychotic with DMHA added. Not crazy insane DMHA, enough to add to that dialed in, focused in feeling where it's just, um, where it just gives you that mental, like additional aspect to it, man, where you're like, you're challenging yourself on the iron, man. I mean, there's no way you're going to take this and not push it to the max with the iron pumping. So it is, it does feel good. There's a, it's a feel good, there's a feel-good element with it. I mean, you're on one. Physical energy, number one. Focus is there. Beta alanine is pretty weak, mild. I just think it's just such a strong pre-workout. It makes the beta kind of weak. And um, you're going, man. So this is what I got for you, man. Strong pre-workout. Alpha Yo base hitter. Plus some DMHA. It's there, man. It's got the goods in it. Nice stim packet. If you want a strong slapper, but not death feeling slapper that kicks in quickly and freaking latches onto you, man, and it's got that, that drive to it, <laughs> get ready, man. Strap on your seatbelt, man. The same for you weak beta males who press snooze on your alarm three times. This is for a strong driven man who, when the freaking alarm goes off in the morning, you get the heck out of bed and you get down to business. That's what I got for you, garage gym homies. Always going to give it to you straight till the end of days. If you like the review, subscribe to the channel. If you didn't freaking like the review, also subscribe to the channel. God bless all of you together. Let's get this dang muscle. I'm out.